Hello YouTubers. This video is a small demo on how to create a backup of your sensitive data, for example, settings. That is very sensitive data, and losing it may cause you a lot of troubles. Let's say, I have a data block with some settings of the motors, and losing those settings would really stress me down. Here are only 5 motors, but that is only an example. Way more settings can be here. As you can see, motors have different settings, and I would be unhappy by losing them. There are various ways to lose that data. Your CPU may be harmed, or MMC defected. Also, you may lose your settings by downloading initialized data block to the CPU, and so on. You may write down parameters by hand on the list of the paper, keep it somewhere and rewrite them back in case of accident. But this is very inefficient way. You can save your online data block with parameters to your project, and download them back in case of accident, or by replacing the CPU, or MMC. First of all we need to create a program folder for our backup. Click on your project, then select insert from menu, then program, and select S7 program. A folder tree will be created for your program. Let's name it as backup. Expand your folder tree. You will find two folders, one for sources, add another one for blocks. In the blocks folder you will find block OB1. You can delete it. Now, let's get back to our project's block folder. And click on online button. All online blocks are here now. Be very careful, if you delete something here, then it will be gone on the CPU. You do work online at this point. Select all blocks, that you want to save. In my case I will save only DB20. By the way, SFCs are not needed to be saved. Copy your selection and go offline. Switch to your backup blocks folder. And paste your online selection here. All selected blocks are copied from the online and saved here. Let's open the data block to find out if the values are also copied. I do get error that UDT is missing. It is normal behavior, because my data block contains UDT data types. Let's proceed with opening the data block. It's all messed up. To get things fixed, we need to copy the corresponding UDT from the offline project, to the backup program folder. Let's try to open DB again. So far things look good. Switch to the data view to see if the data were saved. As you can see, all data were saved, we have a full backup of DB20. Let's try to imitate, that data on the PLC is lost. I will initialize the data block DB20, and download it to the PLC with initial values. You can see, that values are lost. Now we are in need to restore them. Switch to your backup program folder, copy DB20, and paste it into the offline project. Overwrite when asked. Let's look if it contains values. Yes, they all are here. Now, download DB to the CPU. 
let's go online to check if everything is ok. As you can see, all the settings are restored successfully. So, we have successfully created a backup of settings, and later restored them on the CPU. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel if it helped you. Thank you for watching and happy coding.